Melbourne victory back into this game in the last five minutes, 71% of possession. There's Wilkinson with an early ball forward for Danny McGreen. Not bad, great control, Danny McGreen! And he finishes it with a plum. The Mariners take the lead on the counter-attack, and that was brutal from Danny McGreen. Yeah, wonderful finish from Daniel McGreen, but it was just far too open in the heart of that Melbourne victory defence. Alex Wilkinson, the unlikely provider with the long ball over the back of the defence. All of a sudden, Daniel McGreen seemed to be the only one who read the ball. They got sucked towards the play, the Melbourne victory. Leia and Musker got caught too far forward. And then Daniel McBreen strode onto the bouncing ball and he just hammered it with too much power past the oncoming Michael Pekovic. Corner kick to the victory. Hernandez with the delivery. Svansvike, the clearance. Musket calls for the early ball. He gets it. It hangs up in the air. Leia with the clearance. Adrian Leia with the final touch. And Adrian Leia makes amends. The equaliser for Melbourne. Roddy Vargas and Adrian Leia contesting. Doesn't matter who got the final touch, all that matters is Melbourne are back on level terms. Well, it was the high looping ball. Kevin Musket called for it at the far post. It looked as though it had gone too high and too deep, but Musket did a great job to head it back across, and then Leia was too desperate, and he put it back into the six-yard box. They were appealing for offside, but he was played onside by the player in the corner, Marky Musket, and then Rodrigo Vargas, the presence of mind, he didn't try to do too much with it, he just angled it past the goalkeeper. That is subtle as you like from the central defender. Brilliant finish, Vargas. Well, it might have been a bit messy, but it doesn't matter. They all count. And Melbourne now, you would sense, have the momentum. With this very boisterous crowd behind them. Well, they may have been disappointed as a defensive trio to concede that opening goal, but they combined as a trio to force the equaliser. McGreen tried to play an early one in for Matt Simon. So that makes things interesting here at Amy Park. Much needed goal for the home side coming from an unlikely source. As you mentioned, Trimmers, the three defenders. Now Hernandez playing the ball through for Robbie Cruz. Robbie Cruz brought down as he was making a march towards goal by Pitch Bowich. Free kick Melbourne. Yeah, not sure it was delivered. I think Pedro Bowes perhaps had eyes on the football. Cruz, as always, looking to surprise and getting quickly behind while other people aren't looking. And there was a clash of bodies and he went down. I think it was inadvertent. Pedro Bowes trying to get to the contest, perhaps clipping Cruz as he went past. But gee, the intensity is lifted, hasn't it? The crowd on their feet here, urging the home team. A free kick here for Melbourne. Musket and Hernandez standing over the ball. Musket will want to take a quick one. Hernandez will want a shot on goal! Well, he hasn't scored at Amy Park. But how about that for your first? Melbourne in front with the Hernandez classic. Oh, my word, what a goal. Carlos Hernandez stepping up when his team needed him most. Melbourne victory. We said that the crowd was on their feet, baying for something, urging their team on. And Carlos Hernandez, that touch of quality that he possesses. Brilliant free kick, brilliant goal. He responds to his critics in the best way possible. Brilliant stuff from the Costa Rican. Good ball whipped in at the near post. It's almost over the line. It is now, and that is the equaliser for the Mariners. And Adam Kosnick with the final touch, perhaps, to give the Central Coast Mariners their second goal of the evening and put them back on level terms, and a rich vein of form continues.
for Adam Kosnick. Oh, the in-swinging ball, it wasn't pretty by any stretch of the imagination. The pace on the ball was what did the damage, it was low and flat. And then it was a combination of Brebner and Pekovic getting in each other's way in their attempts to clear it. It came off Wilkinson and then Brebner into the outstretched leg of Pekovic. Messy, messy, messy from the Melbourne victory, but the Central Coast Mariners won't mind. Brebner desperate, but then Pekovic, how unlucky is that? 